Greetings and welcome back to the Godfather Dawn's Edition. Where last time, well, bad news. We watched our newly acquired mentor die in front of us. We somewhat avenged him, and then we had to watch the Dawn get shot. We had to help try to save his life by going all over the, uh, well, all over Little Italy to try to get him to the hospital. All the while, just being chased down and attacked, and yeah. What are Corleone the challenges? Oh, that's online stuff. Oh, okay. But in the meantime, now we're gonna have to see what happens next. Yeah, start businesses. But, I think. Eh. Oh, no, this is just calling a driver. Alright. That's... Is that the Corleone compound? Hmm. So instead, we're just gonna... Mosey on over. We need a map. So we could go on and still do some more of these, uh, Tatalias that we got around here. We got Strachi over there. Ooh, looks like a police station. You know what? We gotta do a little revenge, so let's do that. In the meantime, there's a gun right in front of us. I need to check. Yeah, we need a... Don Corleone should be grateful he has men like you. Yep. We need to get ammo. That's what we need. Luckily, we have a lot of money. So, hey, man. Yo. Ready to do business now? Yes. Done and I've been saving this for you. Can I get more than one? Nah, I don't think so. All right, now how much ammo do I have for that? All right, I got a bit. I think you're gonna like this. Nah, I don't think so. Oh no, we can't buy it anymore. All right. Meantime, uh, guess we'll head over. Ooh, let's go over to that uh, Strachi up north there. Just so we can get. Yeah, let's stop there and get some mag uh, Magnum ammo. And then we can go get some shotgun ammo. And. I should probably just go grab a car. That's what I should have done anyway. Oh! Oh god damn, that's fast. Out of my way! I don't know why you guys are running, I'm just literally honking so you don't run I don't run you over. Alright, so reload speed increased. Power attack twenty percent. Knock opponents to their knees. Hmm. Negotiation pressure. That gun accuracy one would be pretty good. What happens if we go back more here? Revealed six seconds longer. You know what? Let's do a little of that. Perfect. Hey man, I like how you're just out in broad daylight. Nice, huh? I'll give you. All right, hand it over. Thank you. And then we just head straight up. Then I guess we can go do some more of that uh, Tatalia stuff. This dress makes me look bad. Whoa! Oh shit! Oh, I'm so glad I didn't actually kill the guy. <laughs> he, he dodged real quick. Ah, uh, they must work for that building there. Somebody 
Hey man, it's all good. I'm just heading down this alleyway. Alright. You guys see any guys down this way? Hmm. Ready to give this one a try? Nice doing business with you, son. Yeah, I'm all good. Alrighty. Hmm. Any way to attract his attention? Just give me a reason, punk. I don't know. Yeah. I thought it was pretty good. Nah, I'm just tired of gangster movies, I guess. <laughs> what do you want? Ooh, you think if I can uh, attract his attention with uh, that? Hey, come on down. Shit. All right, that's not what I wanted to do. All right, well, oh. Oh, dude. Civilian did not want him to be in the way. Oh, no, no. Oh, woo! Miss me, miss me, miss me. Dodge and weave, dodge and weave. I'm surprised the people inside haven't done anything. Alright. Just a little bit of 20 heat. That's fine, that's fine. Alright, there's gonna be more people in here. Right? No, it doesn't look like it. Uh, nope. Alright, well, let's just head upstairs and see what we can do. Really? No one? Alright, well. Little extra money nip doesn't go, doesn't hurt, right? Where is everyone? Are they just all on the roof? No, let's, uh. Really? Did we accidentally kill the, uh, dude? Huh. Well, that's weird. Well, I'm gonna go downstairs and check real quick. Oh, yep, there was just no racket. It was just a simple dude making his way in the world. We killed everyone. Alright, well, let's see here. What kind of protection you got for this place? Need a little? No, you can't force me to pay. I'm just trying to run a business. All right, property damage, huh? You won't be needing this. Ooh. Uh. What that cost? You're in my place. All right, five ninety. That's good. When I'm through here, it'll take a year to put the place back together. All right, I'll pay. Just quit hassling. <laughs> that dude in the background. All right. I need help. Hey, it's fine. I'm getting out of here. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, you better run. Hey, hey, hey. All right. dress makes me look Still, I guess we're waiting on some stuff here. I guess we shouldn't go after the uh safe houses because that seems like we're probably not in the best position for them. So you know what? We're going to go after the... Yeah, this is the uh, compound. But we're going to go after, say, these two here. 
and see if we can do a safe house. Come on. Oh, oh, oops, sorry. Well, I'm sure she's she's fine. We didn't actually, you know, like kill her, I don't think. We didn't hit her that hard. So, how's everyone been doing? Everyone having a good week? There we go. Now we know which one's mine. Hmm. Well, fuck you too. Is it, uh... Nope, there's two, alright. Alright, that's fine. Look, just something for tech. You should focus on running a restaurant. Let me focus on safety. Alright, that was a little creepy, man. Graham, I ain't scared of you. Alright. Unfortunately, there's only these two guys out here. And if we do anything, they're gonna come in, huh? Crack. Step on the crack. Yeah. We can just kill these guys. Oh, there was a third guy? Where the hell did you come from? Oh, shit! Seriously, where the hell did you come from? All right. All right, well. That's not doesn't seem to be your weakness. What if we threatened your customers? No. Let me uh Anyone you know? All right, you know what? We'll do this. Don't be a fucking hero. All right, I don't want to risk it too much. Four hundred. Your restaurant is on my turf. Where's my cut? All right, I'll pay up. I promise. All right, back door unlocked. All right. One second, I'll answer that. Boom. Oh, didn't know there was a third guy there. That's fine. Plant some dynamite. I need to get some uh, ammunition, ammunition for that. Tommy. There, the good dudes got to be up there. I uh, didn't see you have anyone shooting at me. Oh shit! Oh sh Dude was just hiding! Fuck! Alright, I'm gonna go do that one real quick, then I'll go answer the phone. Finish that up. Alright, there we go. We just bought out this dude, we got the most we could out of it, unfortunately. We paid 1200 and we're only gonna get 400 back, but eh. Anyone you know? Yep. They found out where Salato's hiding Tom. Meet Clemenza at his house in Brooklyn, pronto. Alright, guess we're heading to Brooklyn. Oh man. Oh man. Hey man, it's all good. We're just protecting our turf now. Excuse me. Yep. I didn't realize it was Make sure this guy don't get Whoa. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! I forgot the uh, outside protection. They still chasing me? They are. Uh, I need a park car. I need a park car. What the? Good thing the court. Uh, I thought it was pretty good. 
Are they still following me? Hey, watch it, mister. Crap, I'm late. I don't see him. Oh, uh, excuse me. I think we're good now. Someone finally took down that All right, so where in Brooklyn do we need to go? Oh, okay, so it's just straight down. We just went the opposite way, to be honest. Finally, a parked car. That's not a parked car. Well, I, need a drink. I don't. Oh, there is a parked car. I just don't want to get any trouble with the with the heat right now. I says that a guy. Big mistake. So what did he do? At least we got another skill point too. Oh, we had to go all the way to Midtown. There we go. Honestly, I should probably grab some of these trucks. Take them to the uh, safe house. Uh, maybe I'll do it when there's one closer to the safe house. Man, these cars are speedy. Wait. Nope. Sorry, man. Oh, sorry. Woo! There we go. Brooklyn. Just didn't see the big old sign that said Brooklyn. Yeah. All right, just about at the compound here. So thought I'd bring us back in. Not gonna lie, though, look at the compound area. Very fancy. Ooh. I'm liking that. Thanks, son. Pull over. Oh, I'm supposed to pull all over there. Ooh, I don't want to hit anyone else's car. I'm still an outsider. I, I don't have any leeway here. You can always come back here if you get the jam. Be greeted as a friend. Alright, thank you. No money bag found, but I wasn't really looking. And talk to Tom Hagen. Alright, I'll go do that. I'm gonna miss Luca Brazzi. I wanna be just like him. I remember one time he killed one of our own guys just for giving the Corleones a bad name. You're not gonna give the Corleones a bad name, are you? Hell no. Oh, and I bet this is where we can recruit like some of our crew here, huh? But those guys are like higher rank than us. I don't think we could uh, do that. We're not even a member of the family, like I said. So. Incredible. Tom's free and not a scratch on him. I wonder what Salazzo's thinking. He's already shown his hand. I don't know. Nobody kidnaps a consigliere and gets away with it. No, yeah, that's true. All right, let's uh. Just explore the house a bit, right? Oh, there we go. Get some ammo going. We need to find more, like, shotgun ammo and uh, Tommy gun ammo. <laughs> Watch. You're not allowed to be up here, kid. Ooh. Fine, a little bit of health goes a long way, right? More health. Guess these must be guest rooms. Those old fashioned beds reminds me of my grandmother's house. Hmm. Alright. Time to talk to Tom. Anyone else is here yet? Made. Locked. All right, hey Tom. Got any uh, thing to say? Let me speak plainly. The Corleone family has need of men like you, because as we speak, our enemies encircle us, waiting to prey on any sign of weakness. What can I do for the family? We would like to offer you a role as an unofficial enforcer for the family. See that we maintain control in the streets. Help us to regain our true balance. In time, 
you will become a trusted associate to our family. And then, God willing, you will become one of our made men. All right. Promotion to enforcer. Becoming an enforcer is the only the first rank. Complete missions and earn respect. Nice. Any other things to be said real quick? Nah? Alright, let's go for career progress. We're Enforcer. We're technically, like, a member of the family, now that it's signified by the, uh, the lion symbol there, but we're not an associate. So, promotion, next rank, benefits, yeah. So, we gotta start doing things for us to, uh, get promoted there. Thomas report. It's family tree. Oh yeah, it doesn't show us our family tree though. Tatalia is almost no longer peaceful, but I have a feeling the Tatalias are going to hate us by day's end. Alright. Hey man, what's up? Hey, Clemenza's looking for you. Over at the Falconite. Alright. I'll head on over to the Falconite. It's got to be some kind of nightclub. Can I get a driver to drop me off? Their phone? Oh, hi. What's up? Hey, the new enforcer. Congratulations. We all just heard the news. Thanks. It feels good to be part of the family. Glad to hear it, because there's someone important that you should meet. Salvatore Tessio, one of the family's most loyal capos. He's mm. looking for someone to take on a contract hit against the Tatalias. Maybe you're the right man for the job. All right, I at least can hear it out. See what we can do. Mr. Tessio, it's an honor to meet you. How you doing, kid? Got a job for you. You're interested? Uh, I'm sure. For the family. We got a problem with a Italian wise guy, Mikey Soleri. He hangs around that butcher shop you were in for us. Take him out. When you receive a contract, hit a hit list will appear. This place in Fort Killing Your Target, yeah, blah blah blah. Look for look for Mikey Solari in the alley behind Emilio's butcher shop. Solari has been trying to intimidate Corleone shopkeepers. Threatened to kill Emilio the butcher. Use hand to hand combat for a little bonus bonus. Got it. And oh, Santino Corleone. My respects, Sonny. I, I, I mean Santino. It's a privilege to meet you. Do you have any advice for an up and coming enforcer? You know, trucks are a good place to start. I started by robbing trucks. I remember telling Pop uh, I wanted to enter the family business that I could, you know, learn to sell olive oil. He tells me, yeah, every man has one destiny. Well, today, today my destiny is all about wanting what the hell's inside of them trucks and what it does for me, you know what I mean? All right, thanks. I'll worry, I'll talk about those trucks. All right, yeah, but we can hire this dude for a thousand. Yeah, but I think we're uh, good on that. I can't take that car, huh? Uh, Corleone Court. So I guess we'll head over to the butcher shop. Go kill out, take out Mikey Soleri. Maybe do a uh, quick tr truck robbing, and then go meet a. Uh, Clemenza at the Falconite. Alright, here we are. We're right next to the butcher, and Mikey Soleri should be around here. We've parked a little bit further away, just, you know, no one can see us coming. Kill him in hand to hand, eh? Good to see you, sir. Why would they do a day in life? Oh. Butcher shop. Is there a back door out here? No, that go that just goes upstairs. All right, I parked maybe a little too far away. Here we go. This is my hey, Boom, Mikey Solari. Come on, come on, we can get you. Oh shit, no. You know what? I need you to move. There we go. Oh! 
We whacked Mikey. Yes, yeah, sorry, uh, Emilio. Ooh, 100 Vendetta. So as soon as they see us, they're going to be shooting at us. Luckily, we don't have that many uh, Tatalias around us. At least in the immediate vicinity. Guess we can go after the safe house one. Now I'm just going to keep an eye on it for a truck. I'm going to go after that safe house, actually, before we go meet up with Clemenza. See if I can take it, and if I can see a truck on the way, then I'll grab it. Well, I found a truck. Hopefully it actually does have a... Uh, someone in there. I could have been wrong, and that's just a normal truck. Well, that bites. Help somebody. Yeah, I think that was just a normal truck. Whoops. <laughs> my truck. It's worth a fortune to drive it somewhere safe. There we go. To drop off mark. Truck value. All right, we got to go. We got to go. Deliver it to the truck drop off. All right. We've been, sh been shot at for quite a while. But it's a big old truck, hopefully. Yeah, I just forgot how to, uh... I just forgot how to do a free, a, uh... Well, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, ooh, shit! That's why I did it over here. Free aim, that's it. There we go. There, and I'm safe in here, bitches. There. Alright, let's go meet Clemenza. Now we've stolen at least one truck. Yeah. I just totally forgot how to do free aim, and then I just started shooting at the truck, and then the guy got out and started shooting me. Luckily, there were some of our family members around that uh, helped out, but... Uh, the cops were a pain. And this still going on. <laughs> I did not mean to start a turf war. <laughs> Guess I should go actually check it out. Who's actually shooting? Oh, it's this dude who... There we go. There, he's dead, guys. You guys must have been shitty shots. Like, the shittiest of shots, my guys. Alright. <laughs> well, I'll be meeting you in Jersey then. Hey man, what's up? The Don's still in bad shape. Why don't you go over to the hospital in Little Italy and keep an eye on things? You think there's gonna be trouble? The police got the building under wraps, but they're not our guys, and I don't trust them. You know what? Sound advice. Hey man, what's up? You look like you want to talk to me? I know a secret about those delivery trucks. Could earn you a lot of dough. Interesting. I'm interested. What are you thinking? Them trucks ain't all legit. Some are smuggling goods for the mob. Stop them with a little firepower, then interrogate the driver. You'll find out where they're coming from. Well, we already knew that. Yeah. Hey, man, what's up? Barzini's. Nah, they seem okay. Keep to themselves, pretty much. Really? Just gonna... Alright, there we go. We're getting learning about the families. There are five families out there, kid. Each controlling their own neighborhood. First, there's the Tatalias from Brooklyn. Bruno Tatalia is next in line to be done, and is working with that Turk asshole Salazzo. Tatalias are tough, but nothing you can't handle. As for Brooklyn, the heights is pretty rich, but watch out near the waterfront. If I had a dime for every cheap hotel, brothel, or sleazy clip joint, I'd be a very wealthy man. Look into the face of Astrachi, and you'll see one thing. Trouble. 
You don't want to run into them on a dark night in the New Jersey stronghold. At first, the place looks pretty quiet. All little shops, fancy parks. But watch out. Better bring a crew with you before paying the Strachis a visit. Hell's Kitchen is one of the city's toughest neighborhoods, controlled by the Cuneo. They ain't rich. A few gambling clubs and brothels, plus some weapons. Hell's Kitchen is a sewer full of burned down tenements and empty warehouses. The rail yards are a rat's nest of scumbags and late night wheeling. And Daredevil. <laughs> Midtown is the heart of New York. You got all those famous landmarks that you've seen in pictures. Plus the biggest hotels, swankiest nightclubs, and the most valuable rackets in town. One family controls Midtown, the Barcini. They're tough sons of bitches. Don Emilio Barcini is in charge and rules with an iron fist. Yeah, I know him. And finally, there's us, the Corleones. Little Italy used to be our turf, but the rival families kept moving in and hitting our businesses. We gotta stop them, kid. Take the families out one by one. But when you look up at that big sign, Jenko Olive Oil, you know, on Mott Street, that's when you know you're home. So that's the front for the Corleones. You know what? I've seen The Godfather years ago. I just couldn't remember that. All right. Oh, what's up with you then? Strachis are brutal. They ain't fighting some other family. They'll fight each other. Oh, all right. Getting the lowdown on all the families is actually pretty good, I'd say. Anything down here? No? Oh, nothing of important anyway. Alright, time to go hit up the uh, hospital. Go see how the Don's doing. Oh, what's up? The Detalias have gone soft. Just knock them over and poof, they're gone. You can trust the Cuneo, but mess with their business and you're a dead man. Well, that's actually good to know. Okay, time to go. Oh, what's up? Salazzo might make another attempt on the Don's life. He needs protection. And that's what I'm gonna do. First things first, though, before we head there, I need to go load up on, uh, some ammunition. So I'm gonna head over down this way real quick. And then I'll meet you all at the hospital. Alright, just taking out this, uh, club and this, uh, racket up here. Got a favor? Oh, I can, uh... Flirt. You should be in pictures. You're prettier than Lane Stansfield. You're melting my heart, lover boy. And baby, I got something else you might like. Oh. Oh yeah. What is it? Oh shit. On the little Italy Felici. You know, nobody's seen his wife for weeks, and all of a sudden he's hanging out at the cemetery an awful lot. So. So I gotta paint you a picture. Look, you should visit the cemetery. Behind old St. Patrick's Cathedral. If that chief's hiding something, you're sure to find it there. Alright. Interrogate the grave digger. I know we gotta go ahead to the hospital, but I think the... Hospital is, uh, yeah. Right behind, right next to the church. So let's go do that. So right behind the church, so we'll throw that there. Now we might be gaining a little trouble since I did just, uh take this place nope yeah I knew that was gonna happen <laughs> all right let's just get out of here see what's at the cemetery right all right let's go see what's we gotta interrogate the grave digger eh Maybe we can just buy him out. A little pay doesn't hurt anyone, right? Beat it, Mac. Let me. What do you know about the police chief? Why is he always snooping around here? No, please. I can't. Oh. Uh... All right. There's his weak point. And there we go. Okay, okay, look. 
The chief ain't snoofing. He's visiting. His wife. He offed her after a fight, and he paid me to bury the body. Interesting. Well, he killed his own wife. Why should I believe you? It's true. Look, he tried to stiff me for the job, so I swiped the wife's jewelry before I buried her. Here, take it. Just don't kill me. Fine. You know, the dead wife's brooch belonged to the police chief of Little Italy. Confront the police chief at Harry's Bar in Little Italy. How far away is that? Uh, Harry's Bar. Yeah. I'll be honest, I don't, uh... Banks. Harry's Bar. Harry's Bar. I need it. Well, I'm going to go off to find Harry's bar real quick. All right, now I'm thinking this is Harry's bar right here where we started off. But let's just check here. Let's say you let me in for a quick drink, huh? Okay, just don't cause any trouble, right? Club unlocked. You guys see the police chief anywhere? Uh, maybe he's... Upstairs? Oh no, this is the Falcon Eye. Doi. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Alright, well, where's the next area? Just on the street. Maybe this will be the bar. Alright, so... I should have actually checked the map because it actually tells you who owns what. <laughs> So finding Harry's bar would have been a lot easier than me just randomly walking around. But now that we're here, let me just double check here. Career progress? No, I need... He... Alright, the totalities are peaceful. I can get out. Just to, you know, enter this place. I also should have known because of the great big in, uh, police badge. Chief, I think I've been paying too much for your services. I want a discount, understand? What do I look like, a five and dime? Why should I be doing you any favors? Because, Chief, I know what you did to your wife. I know about the grave. And see this? I can make sure this becomes front page news, unless you cooperate. Okay, okay, look, please, stay quiet about this. I, I promise you, from now on, no more raw deals. If you ever need the heat drop, just, just talk to me. Got it. Make things easier in the neighborhood. If you bribe him, his beat cops will turn a blind eye. Alright, thanks. Can I bribe you now? Hey, man. This is a tough town. Lots of trouble around here. I can keep you safe. Got it? Why should I pay you anything? Come on, I'm just a working guy. Uh, I can't really do anything with a cop here, I don't think. What do you think? Think I can... Your hands off of me. All right, he's not gonna do anything. The cops will hear about Stop. I'll pay. See, he's not gonna do anything, man. Let me go. The cops will hear about this. Hmm. Oh yeah. See, he's not gonna do anything. There we go. Get something worse than a hangover if you don't pay me what I want. Looks like I don't have much choice. I'll pay. There we go. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this racket real quick, and then we'll head to the hospital. Sure thing, Mike. The police chief really helped me out there. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, now they're shooting at me. Oh no, they're not. There we go. Yeah, they the police really helped me on this one. Hey, thanks, man. All right, let's head to the hospital now. All right, so uh, it took a little bit, but here we are at the hospital, and we're gonna do this before we end the video, I say. So let's do that. There was a lot of uh, detours there. I actually took over that little area where Harry's bar is, so. 
Uh, the hospital is deserted, Tessio's men have been sent away, and only a few guards remain. Inside, Don Vito lies helpless to the destiny that awaits him. Francis Frankie Malone Monk's sister, is she just another temptation? Wait, seriously, I'm just gonna, I'm not even gonna go in the guard, I'm just watching the front. Hey, no problem. I guess I better go in. Uh, hey. Yeah? I was thinking, maybe we should, you know. No. No. We really shouldn't. Oh. But we will. Oh, okay. What a dame. Check in with the security guard, huh? How's it going there, Chief? Hey, no weapons inside. Hand him over. No problem. You know where Monk Malone is? You mean Marty Malone? He's upstairs, second floor. All right. Well, there's a you gun over there. Back when you leave. Locked. Find Monk's room. Guess I'm not allowed that way. Hmm. There's the Don. Can't go in. A few flowers should brighten the place up. So what's up? Well, well. He's my kind of nurse. <laughs> so you decided to come look up my little brother after all? Wouldn't have missed it for the world. Thanks. Starting to look like his old self again, right? Hmm? What was that? Go check out what that noise was. Oh, shit! Time to die, Don Corleone. Don Corleone, come out. You can't hide forever. Go to escape. Play time's over. It's your move. Bastard. Come on. No. Come on, tough bastard. Ah. Give me your gun. Get Frankie out of here. I'm, so I'm sorry. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Michael Corleone. Men are coming here tonight to kill my father. I'm here to help. Clemenza sent me. What happened to the police? The guards? I don't know, but I have an idea. I'm gonna get the nurse to move my father to another room. Oh, you better get your girl out of here. There's a way out to the basement. Go find Tom Hagen. Tell him what's going on. And keep away from the front door. They may be out there already. Clear the basement of assassins, huh? Well, we gotta go downstairs and grab a... Just lie here, Pop. Oh, hey, there's the money bag. I'll take care of you now. I'm with you now. I'm with you. We need to get to the basement. Yeah, where's Come that on, shotgun? Let's go. There we go. Hey, talk. Let's go. Downstairs? You lead. All right, move. How much ammo did we get for the shotgun? All right, stick with the pistol for now. There go more of them. Get. Yeah. Anyone? Ooh, a bat. A little bit of, a little bit of dough, but we don't need that. Oh shit. Should have been more insightful there. Anyone? No. Dropping any ammo? Nice. Frankie? Frankie? You should wait here. I'll make sure the coast is clear. Okay, but be careful. Don't worry. They won't know what hit them. Actually, you know what? No. You okay? Yeah. 
but I think I still hear more of them. Yep. All right, come on, we can do this. Oh shit! Come on, come on! I gotta aim for the head. Up. Oh. All right. Come on. I got him. What's giving me? I meant to pull out the pistol. There we go. Ooh, nice medicine. Think I'd see more in the hospital, but whatevs. Missed. All right, no one in that corner. I saw you, motherfucker. Nice. Oh. Uh, here we go. You think you can just rush right in here? Nice. All right. Frankie, are you going to be okay? Yes, I'll be fine. Go on. The Don needs you. Thanks for saving me. I'll go get Tom. All right, well, I hope she'll be okay. Find Michael Corleone. All right, not enough ammo. Oh! As long as I can kill these guys real quick and grab uh, a lot of pistol ammo, that's all I need. Oh, Michael. Follow me. We've got to cover the front entrance. All right. Not a fucking muscle. I thought I got all you guinea hoods locked up. What the hell are you doing here? What's the Turk paying you to set up my father, Captain? Take a hold of him. Stand him up. Stand him up straight. Told you not to get involved, didn't I? Oh shit! I'm attorney for the Corleone family. These men are private detectives hired to protect Vito Corleone. If you interfere, you'll have to appear before a judge in the morning to show cause. I mean, I knew where the money bag was. I just couldn't get it. I mean, I guess I could have gotten it after all this, but. That fucking Turk. Can you believe the balls on that guy? Yeah, that's two attempts on Don Corleone's life. Thank God we had some people here to help out. Who knows what could have happened if he was alone? Well, with Monk still laid out and Paulie always gone, Don's gonna need all the help he can get. Yeah, but Paulie always gone. I wonder why Paulie's always gone. Fine. Sorry, sir. Alright, I'm assuming get a hit contract. Alright, fine, I'm heading back to the safe house. It's just down the street. Oh hi, what's up? Hey, Clements is looking for you. Over at the shop on Mulberry. Alright. We'll head over here. Actually, we're gonna end it there, so let's head to uh the safe house and do a quick save. Then we'll head over to Clemenza next time. But yeah, that's going to be this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are, suggestions. If you guys got any uh, interesting little trivia, let me know. I'm, I'd am i be down to be hearing that and curious and all. But yeah. Hope you all enjoyed. Leave a like if you like, leave a dislike if you dislike, but tell me why, and I shall see you all, give me a second, later.